it's morning and my brush -o samples from last night have dried. See if I can get it in such a way that you can see the pigments. So where you see the most concentrated color, that'll still stay in your hands. I also had areas where I applied it, where it just bunched up and it never dissolved. And I wasn't going to saturate the paper too much in an attempt to get it to dissolve. So I think I'm putting way too much brush out on my paper. Now today I'm going to go ahead and swatch all my brush out. So what I did was I went ahead and I removed all of these plastic caps and I shaved, saved them to show you because that's that was a lot of work, it's a lot of garbage. But um, I'm happy that they were packed in such a way that they could be secure even if my postal service treated them like garbage, which they didn't, by the way. I'm just saying, like, they took necessary precautions, which I appreciate. At this point in time, my colors are in no particular order because, well, they're in the order they came in. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do swatches and then I'm going to cut out and probably regret doing all this, cut out, um, like, a circular swatch or maybe even a square one. I don't have a paper punch this small. Um, and then tape it to the top. So I have an easy reference. And to do that, I'm going to need something with which I can apply the brush out. And um, I think using a pipette didn't really work all that well last night. So I think I'm gonna find something else. Um, this might be regrettable. Like maybe like a cheap nylon brush. Flick it on, we'll see. So this is light brown. And that's what light brown looks like inside the tube. And yeah, actually, this used to work when I wore Bare Minerals 10 bajillion years ago. So maybe it'll work like that. And then I need to clean off the brush. And the paper. I mean, this stuff will get everywhere, so I gotta find a solution that is um, not so prone <laughs> to being messy. Okay, so that's light brown. I think I'm gonna have to let allow my samples to dry in between. They're gonna get everywhere. And I'm still having problems with like proper dispersal. So I think I'm also going to um, like check out some other videos in the next few weeks and see if I can find some tips. So this is probably gonna take me all day because I gotta let it dry and then um, I was thinking about doing like a speed time lapse thing, but I want to announce, well, maybe I don't have to announce the colors because I'm going to write them down anyway. All right, I guess I'm going to do a speed thing with this.